All right, so what is up, YouTube? Did not mean to click on that, but here we are. This finally came out. The most broken card, or one of the most strongest monsters to be released in 2017, is Sea Monsters of Th Thesis or Thesis or whatever, however you pronounce it, and it's a zombie fusion tuner. Now the tuner, I was completely, I, I completely caught that one because I've been thinking. I said, what, what, what fusion would be broken? I mean, when I, when I seen it was a fusion, I was like, okay, <clears throat> there's only two. I mean, there's only really one way you can break a fusion is to make it a tuner. That's what they did. I completely caught that. Now I did get one thing wrong, was that it was going to be two, two any two monsters, which I really believe that they should have did. They should have easily just did two monsters. That would have made this way more stronger. But for them to say it's one of the strongest monsters would be released, it has me thinking that something in Rage and Tempest in the TCG exclusive side works with this and breaks this card. That's what I'm thinking. I think it breaks this card. And I think they're just giving us a little, what's the name, a little, uh, I guess, preview because they know what's happening or it's going to work with something later on or in Fusion Asian Forces that's just really going to break this card. So, Because so far, the best play you can do with it is go into a damn fucking Tzokin. That's the best play you can do. Um, well, Trish is cool, but like I said, the best play is Tzokin because it <clears throat> gives you more more... Then just it, it just gives you more for you, more bang for your buck. So you can just spell something like a cyber dragon, or I don't know any galaxy soldier, and just bam, you could fucking brilliant fusion, which they did mention. And I want to get onto these two um, because uh, really what I want to pay attention to is the cards they use. They telling you to use. They're telling you to use Gemini Seraphne. So that makes me think brilliant fusion is not going to get hit. Um, or at least not hit, not not getting banned. Brilliant Fusion is not getting banned because they wouldn't tell you to use a car for 2017 if they're just going to ban it. That's just dumb. I just don't think they'll do it. I think they're being a little telltale uh, with this little article. As you can see, they have a whole bunch of cards. But you know what they don't mention, which is really weird. They don't mention Level Eater. I mean, as far as I read, they don't mention one right here. They don't mention it anywhere. Like, why would you not mention literally the best level one for fusions? I mean, not fusions, for fucking synchros. Why would you not mention it in this when you're trying to promote this card? So that makes me think that's getting banned. And then since it's, it's a zombie that you can, not a zombie, but it's a fusion that you can summon with instant fusion, that means Norden is going to get banned. So I think level eater is confirmed to get banned and Norden is pretty much, I would say 95% sure to uh, get banned because you can't leave Norden with this. Like, that's just dumb. That's just, that's not smart. You're not going to promote this card because I'm not going to play this over Norden. Like, Norden has to leave for me to even consider playing this. Now, if I'm playing Synchros, still, as a far shot, you're not going to replace Norden for this. That's just not going to happen. So, I believe Norden, and because they did not mention Level Eater nowhere throughout this whole thing, is that that's going to get hit. Because who the fuck is going to Synchro with Abysmal Gear? Like, come on, man. <laughs> Nobody's going to do that. That's stupid. And if you was going to single with Bisman Gear, you're just going to use Gofu. You're not going to use this. So that's just dumb. Like, there's no reason to There's no reason to even say that. Like, there's, it's just stupid. So I think Level Eater in fucking Norden is definitely going to get banned. But for it to be a zombie, it's cool. But like I said, I don't, I, I, not like I said, but I don't know any combos as of right now. You guys, if you guys came up with any combos, Please let me know because I would definitely like to try it. Um, <clears throat> tomorrow's video is going to be sure I knew Zodiac Zombies because I've already pre-recorded earlier today because I completely forgot today was Tuesday and they was going to release this card or I would have waited and did it later, but I've already recorded it. So you guys definitely look out for that video. That video is just fun as fuck. But yeah, I just wanted to do a quick little video, give you guys my thoughts on it. Let me know what you think of it. Do you like the card? Is it broken? Do you see any extra plays with it? I know what I I know what I can do. I know I can instant fusion this. Summon synchro fusion this. Synchro into a power tool. Get a search a brilliant fusion. Wait, can it search brilliant fusion? I'm pretty sure it can. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it can. Search brilliant fusion. Do the same. I mean, do the play, and then get a mizuki or something i don't know this this card is just eh, it's all right uh like i said i don't know any combos as of right now but i'm gonna definitely think later on and after this video gets done i'm definitely gonna go into a little zombie toolbox and look and see what cards this can be used with but <clears throat> vampires can definitely use this card that'd be good 
But yeah, so thank you guys for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. Click add to help support the channel. Let me know your thoughts below on uh, on this card. What what combos do you see that can be used already? Do you think that it's broken? Do you like the card? Do you think it's going to help zombies out? I don't know. If they would have just gave us a four-star fucking tuner for free, we would have been all right. But no, we don't get that. We get a five-star. <laughs> but I'm not going to complain. It is more zombie support, even though it's not even... Technically for zombies, it is a zombie card. So I'm not tripping. I enjoy it. Um, just hopefully we do get like a TCG exclusive card, which would be like, that'd be so fucking fun to have that. But pretty sure we're not. But anyways, <clears throat> yeah, let me know your thoughts below. Thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys tomorrow.